Hello traders, this is Courage from TradingWithTan.com. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to place two or more indicators on one indicator window for MetaTrader 5 on your PC. On your phone, it's very easy. All you need to do is go to indicators. You click the first indicator, maybe the MACD, you select, and then maybe you want to add one more indicator. Let's add the Bollinger Band on top of this MACD. Then you click F+, plus, then indicator window, you place Bollinger Bands and as you can see right now I have the MACD and the Bollinger Bands on one indicator tab right now but when it comes to your PC most people find it difficult to add their indicators on top of other indicators so let me show you how to do that step by step So the first thing that you want to do is go to view once you go to view you scroll down to navigator once you scroll down to navigator you are going to see uh, your accounts the indicators you are going to see the expert advisors script services market signals vps right now let's go to indicators once you go to indicators you are going, we are going to find the macd first the macd once i, I double click the macd and I will set the parameters and I'm gonna set close once I do that you can see we have the MACD right here with the red line and the blue histogram now let's say I want to add the Bollinger Bands on top of this MACD all I need to do is go to the indicators on trends right click on trends then I'm gonna find the Bollinger Bands right here so instead of double clicking it I'm gonna drag and drop on top of that MACD. Once I do that, it's, it's gonna tell me to select the parameters. I'm gonna select 200 deviation two, and then I'm gonna apply to first indicators data, and then I'm gonna select okay. Once I do this, you can see that we have our Bollinger Bands right on top of our MACD. So there are other uh, strategies that can help you if you do this type of uh indicators because you can say for the for example one strategy that i know is if the macd touches the lower body of the bollinger bands maybe the market is about to reverse and go up as you can see from here we have our macd uh out of the lower bands here and then from there you can see that the market started moving up as the macd started moving up you can see again here the MACD touches the upper band and we see the upper band uh, the market is right here on top and from there as the MACD started moving down the market started moving down right again here you can see that uh, the MACD was on the upper on top of the upper band here and then we see uh, uh, from there the MACD started moving down and then when uh, the market started also moving down it's a very simple strategy if you want to learn more about this strategy leave me uh a, a, just leave a comment below and i'm gonna show you how it works now let's say i want to add again the moving average let's say i want to add the moving average i'm gonna drag and drop on top of this indicator i'm gonna select period two and i'm gonna select a nice green color to period two and I'm gonna add <coughs> add this right as you can see I have the indicate the green indicator is the moving average and the red indicator is the MACD and then the blue indicator is the Bollinger Bands as you can see this is all on one indicator maybe your strategy is when the two period moving average crosses the red line of the MACD you place an order for example right here you could have placed an order right here you could have placed a sell order again right here you could have placed a buy order right here you could have placed another buy order right here so it's a very profitable strategy if you want to know it leave the comment in the comment box below so thank you for watching this video if you are new to this channel make sure to subscribe and if you if you are a returning viewer i really really appreciate you leave a comment and leave a like and i'm gonna see you in the next video.